Hey, I'm Billy Drain from Miller Industries, and today we're going to talk about the Century 5130. The 5130 is the most popular, best-selling, heavy-duty towing and recovery vehicle on the market today. The 5130 is a 25-ton wrecker that can be set up in a couple different applications. It can be done as a single axle configuration, or also can be done in a tandem axle configuration, like you see here today. The 5130 in a single axle application is great for inner city towing. In a tandem axle application, like you see here, it can tow almost anything going up and down the interstate today. In the design of the 5130, one of its most prominent features is its weight forward design. When installing a 5130 on a cabin chassis, we're going to add right around 2,000 pounds of weight to the front steer axle. That's where you want that weight to be in any kind of tow truck. Having that front axle weight gives you more control, better steering, and better braking ability. Also, by adding that weight further forward, that takes weight off the drives, giving us more payload capacity so that we can scale better. The drive axles in this configuration that you see here are going to weigh right at about 21,000 pounds when it leaves our factory. The underlift on the 5130 is the money maker of this machine. On the 5130, we use the same underlift that we use on our Century 7035, which is a 35,000 pound rated underlift. This underlift has 128 inches of reach. It's rated at 35,000 pounds fully retracted and 16,000 pounds fully extended. We use a fabricated 5x5 crossbar with a large pin and increased thrust area for maximum durability. The 5x5 crossbar used on the 5130 is the same crossbar that we use throughout the heavy duty product line. That makes the fork receivers and attachments interchangeable in between units. The 5130's recovery boom is rated at 50,000 pounds fully retracted and 16,000 pounds fully extended. That recovery boom paired with two DP planetary 25,000 pound winches gives you maximum versatility for recovery situations. One of the trademark designs of the Century Heavy Duty product line is the rear diagonal jack legs. The 5130 offers these rear diagonal jack legs to give you maximum stability during recovery situations. The rear jack leg is very versatile in its design. You'll notice that it has either a flat pad base stabilizer that can be used on an asphalt or concrete situation. Also that flipper foot, the pin can be pulled out and the greater blade spade can be put down into the aggregate in order to give you more stability for a rear pull. The jack leg also offers a low pull D-ring that is standard on all 5130s that will give you that tie back point low on the jack leg. The tailboard of the 5130 was designed with recovery situations in mind. In addition to the low pull D-rings on the jack legs, there's also four additional tie back points on the tailboard. The outside tie back lugs gives you an additional anchor point on the tailboard as well as the D-ring just inside of that that are also standard. Standard in all of our heavy duty products are these 14 foot grade 100 safety chains. As well as being used for a safety chain for towing, they can also be fully removed for an additional chain for recoveries. Now let's talk about the boxes on the 5130. We use an all aluminum construction for lightweight design that is also corrosion resistant for those tough chemicals, road salt, snow, and ice. On this 5130 configuration, we offer four large upright compartments and we let you as the operator or the owner choose how you want to set those up. We do have a lot of the heavier components, your forks, your attachments, things of that nature up in the forwardmost compartment to put that weight further forward on that front axle like we talked about earlier. In the other boxes you have some, some versatility to be able to set things up either on the driver or passenger side and incorporate different options or accessories that you may choose, including the tire lift, a seven drawer toolbox, or sh additional shelf kits. In most configurations, a 5130 can be equipped with a front crossover pass-through box in the forwardmost compartment. In, that, in this forwardmost compartment, you also see we have our forks and attachment storage up here, and then that crossover box allows you area to, to put those larger items like drive shafts, pieces of aluminum angle iron, maybe your, your timber, things of that nature. And then up top, you'll see the storage tubes for your long handle tools, brooms, shovels, things of that nature. Not all 25 ton records are created equal, and the Century 5130 is no exception. On top of all the great features and benefits that we've already covered, there's a few things that we want to make sure that you understand that come standard with each and every one of our units. And one of those features is the standard wireless underlift remote. This remote comes on all of our units from a 4024 all the way through a 1075. 
and offers you wireless control of your underlift functions. One of the nice upgrades that's available on the 5130 is you can upgrade this to control your boom and winch functions as well. Another standard feature is the remote door locks for the toolboxes. The 5130 comes standard with two key fobs that can lock and unlock the doors at the single click of a button. The 5130 comes standard with nine sets of heavy duty cast steel frame forks. This includes the newly designed 5 inch wide axle fork to accommodate the Hendrickson SteerTech axles. Other attachments that are standard in the 5130 are the spring lift adapters and the hook end caps as seen here. If you're interested in finding out more about the Century 5130, visit our website for more detailed specifications. If you're interested in purchasing a 5130, maybe kicking the tires and getting a feel for the unit, make sure you contact your local Miller Industries distributor. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our news feed for all the latest tips and tricks from Miller Industries. Miller Industries, the world leader in towing and recovery equipment. This video is for product demonstration purposes only and is not intended for training or instructional purposes. Situations vary and operators should rely on their own professional knowledge and safety procedures when conducting actual recoveries.